at least you get around. It's different when you're on vacation. Right. But if you when live you here. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So now I know. Definitely get the SUV. <laughs> right? Oh, this is, this this is, is a project. It's like doing a squat every time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And I so I for, completely forgot about the hot dog sign. Then I said we had to take it on our way oh, here. Oh, right here. Yeah. Oh, the okay. Sign. Yes. This is beautiful. We saw Hako Beach from every angle, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is. Yeah, we so didn't even this area. Here. This we call it Roca Loca, which means Roca. crazy rock. Oh. Roca Loca, crazy Roca. rock. Mm -hmm. But it's the people that go serving here that are crazy, not the rock. <laughs> See, I was asking if there are date trees here. I'm sure you've heard of palm oil. Before, yes, right? palm yes. Oil that comes out of these trees right here. So I just wanted to come and say, when you are going to Manuel Antonio, make sure you get your tickets ahead of time online. I'll put the official site below and make sure you get a guide. I will also put our guide's information down below because if you don't have a guide, you're honestly not going to see animals the way that you will see a slight preview in this video so tickets online make sure you get a guide when you are driving there do not stop for anyone that are trying to slow you down because they are basically frauds <laughs> they cannot sell you tickets and they most likely will try to just basically take your money say that they would guide you but they won't so again i'll go ahead and put all the information below do not stop for anyone when you're on the way. It's okay to buy things um, from the shops, but don't stop for any of those quote-unquote park rangers. They're not official, okay? You will only stop for people when you're in the actual park, but no one in the actual park will try to sell you tickets as a guide, okay? Even if they come close to you, don't touch them. iguana or the black iguana. Which is the second largest so if you just listen to him, so I don't have to talk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not how that works. Clouds, you know, it's it's the stars is amazing, but you need a stronger one for that, or you can use one of those apps or whatnot, right? But wow, blueberry balls. Mm -hmm. uh, these are the monkey brush. So the white-faced monkey, monkey. Yeah, the white-faced monkey is considered the smartest monkey of the new world. And they use tools. So they use, for example, things they can find in the nature. They use this to brush through their fur. Oh, they use other vegetation. They use other vegetation for bug spray. <laughs> they use rocks to open seeds, things like that. That's why. Uh, girls, come and take a look at this. this is
so the tour is going great so far. We've seen a couple of sloths. Um, we've seen like just wildlife. We haven't seen any monkeys in this park as of yet. Um, but I think right now we're about to actually just head to the beach. So yeah, it's been really, really fun. I'll sit here and wait for you guys. Please make sure we don't lose our car keys. Oh, you know it's in the thing. If it gets in your eyes, you might go blind. Okay, let me just rinse my hands. So, because I'm like, it's about to fall down. Yeah, it's a different. Hey guys, so it is our last night, and we are heading to one of the restaurants that we've been practically eating at this whole time, <laughs> and um, it feels so surreal. Hmm. Um, today it's been kind of raining early today which I'm actually kind of grateful for because any other time during the trip it wasn't um, no I have that backwards it's raining towards the middle of the day today which is great because it's our last day but while we were here it would rain like at night time so we only really got caught in the rain like maybe once or twice so that wasn't bad but yes we're headed to our final farewell dinner um so i'll probably see you guys when i get there um i was just laying down my edges Ooh. oh 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 you know oh you lying oh my goodness what the heck? Let me see. Yeah. Um, what it is is that it's because I used only the got to be glued and maybe, oh my gosh, I haven't had it do this in like ages. No. <gasps> but they're late though. Headed to the farewell dinner. <laughs> so I'm gonna turn music off. It's pretty, but so yeah. Our restaurant's outdoors, so we definitely gotta eat under the thing today. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> so, the place actually isn't that far, which is great. All the places that we've been eating at has been like four minute drive at the most. Yeah, literally one full tank of gas lasted us the whole time we was here. But we gotta oh, fill shit. it up. Why was she put the emergency break on? We gotta oh, fill it up God. tomorrow. <laughs> I think yeah, they're all just so used to doing that with like the hills and stuff like that. Like we right by the gas station. So when we leave. So we are here for the vegan flavors. I got some vegan ice cream after our dinner. It's really good. It is so dark, y'all. Like, dang, it's dark as heck. Okay, 
Okay, you guys are gonna have to wish us luck because. Huh? I said we're gonna grow from this because now we're gonna be able to be dropped anywhere and figure that shit out. Girl. Did something catch me on my neck, girl? These motherfuckers. Y'all, we are trying to head out now, and we don't technically right now have GPS, so we don't know how this is going to work. We've screenshotted what we could... I even put in how long does it take to go like a whatever kilometers it is so that like we can set alarms and stuff like that. I don't know how we we fit to do this, but we're gonna have to try to make our way back to San Jose to drop off the car. Our flight is at one. Now we have enough time to kill as far as our flight, but it's the COVID test. So I don't know. We're just going to have to like see how this works. Yeah, we're going to have to see how this works. So I'm going to be keeping you guys posted. We should be leaving in like the next couple minutes. I'm so nervous, but I feel like we'll be fine. We screenshotted all the directions that we could. I tried to screenshot like some ge geographical stuff, but maps wasn't really allowing me to do it properly. So I have no idea, but it's raining as well. So hopefully, I don't think it's raining in San Jose, which is great. Um, and it's raining light right now. Like it's not raining like heavy, kind of like how it was last night and this morning. So yeah, we are gonna see y'all. We are gonna see. Y'all, we are running. We're actually a half hour behind, but um, we're making a stop to our guy Roger at the beach so we can buy some stuff from him before we leave because we told him we was coming back and we haven't um, had a chance to come back yet so and which stone is this this, this is stone um uh, Agatha de Fuego I got the fuego I got the fuego I got the fuego okay I got that the fuego, okay. Agatha de fuego. De fuego. Sí. okay and what's the English in, um, English Agatha I get, I get, I get, yeah, I get okay. the fuego. shuttle to take us back to the airport so that we can um, basically wait for um, wait for our results and we can't check in until we have our results and our flight is at like 145 and I know sometimes they're like oh we're international flights you got to be there two hours in order to check in so hopefully they're not acting crazy when we get there I don't think so though today has been such a breeze Oh, 
I was trying to fix the lighting, but yeah, it's a little too dark now. Girl, the tan is ridiculous. <laughs> so yeah. I guess I'll probably just get me a donut and a water or like an apple juice. They, now I know they got the juices because that day. <laughs> so, y'all, we are on the. <laughs> hey, mm, let me tell y'all this bullshit about this white lady up front. So, we coming down the aisle. <laughs> Sis, not only. And her husband because he part of the bullshit too. But she puts her look. First, she puts it up. Let's start there. So, her husband must have put the shit up. Then takes it down. So, I'm thinking gotta be some life-saving emergency meds in here right bitch took out a book she held up the entire line to enter the plane so she could take out a book so then we're like okay fuck it you got your book out now this bitch put her luggage further from her chair so now she gotta cut through us to get her seat and i was like are you serious she even tried to say like you know oh no no i was like hey can you just step out behind We'll all pass through and you can no I'm just going in it. <laughs> but her yeah. husband stood in the back. He went in a row, but like she was yeah, she was not trying to hear that whole scoop back. No, she wasn't. <laughs> she wanted to sit down. Yeah. She and I feel bad for that guy because he's like, well, he'll probably have to see Okay. Oh, that's the video, yeah. <laughs> All right, that concludes the Hako Costa Rica vlog. I really appreciate you all for watching. I am now home editing these videos. Everything that I talked about in each of the vlogs will be in all of the description boxes so that you don't have to keep going back to different videos just to get the information that you need. If you have any questions about Hako San Jose, don't hesitate to reach out to me in the comments. I would be more than happy to respond and I will see you guys in my next travel vlog. Thank you again for watching.